Starting next year, these bags will no longer be an option when you're shopping in Albuquerque. Shoppers are going to have to leave with one of these paper bags or bring one of their own like these recyclable bags we see so much at the stores. Now, Target 7 found out how this will impact you at the cash register. For years, grocery stores have asked paper or plastic, but soon that won't be an option. After a lengthy debate, the Albuquerque City Council passed an ordinance that bans plastic bags from grocery stores and retailers. This is the new thing, right? More than 200 cities around the country have done something on plastics. So what will this mean when you go to the grocery store? It won't affect the way we do business. If anything, it'll help us out. Plastic bags cost grocery stores about one cent each. Paper bags, about seven cents. And the new legislation allows grocery stores to pass that expense on to the customer. As for shoppers, their thoughts on the plastic bag ban are a mixed bag. You have anything that's oh, frozen, yeah. it's going to melt, and then you'll the paper will break, so it's kind of useless. I think, you know, they should get rid of the paper ones too. It's like people have enough bags at home, right? I'm not happy for groceries to cost extra because of the bags changing or whatever. For months, what has been called the plastic ban ordinance has been debated. At one point, it looked to prohibit plastic straws, utensils, and containers from restaurants. But several amendments were made at Monday's meeting to focus the ordinance on one thing. No more plastic bags in retail businesses in Albuquerque. Everything else we're going to look at down the road. If you order takeout at a restaurant, you will still get a plastic bag. Restaurants are exempt from the ordinance. You'll also get a plastic bag covering your clean clothes at the dry cleaner. But at grocery stores and the mall, all, it's paper only. Now we reach out to Smith's, Albertsons, and Walmart to ask them if the new ordinance will affect what they charge customers. They have not responded, any of them. The ban goes into effect January 1st. <laughs>